I still can't believe Robert told the truth to the police. He must be some sort of cat. Well, if he hadn't, we'd be having a very different Christmas right now. Oh, he'll find a way to use it against us, trust me. Right, I'm going to go and have a shower, and then I thought that maybe we could hit the sales. Unless you're leaving us today, that is. No. Robert knows I'm here now. I just want to stay a few days longer. Go on, both of you. Go and spend a fortune. <laughs> Give me a chance to dote on Seb. I thought we opened all the presents yesterday. Ah, uh, yes. They're... They're from Robert. I, uh, He asked me if I would make sure that Seb gets them, and I... Uh, I felt obliged, but um, I, I can always throw them away if you want me to. Uh, I know Robert said he'd change for Seb, but I never actually believed him. Maybe because he's a consummate liar? At least we know now why he didn't drop you in it with the police. Yeah, so you can make sure Seb got these. I suppose it's quite sweet. Please tell me you're not actually falling for this. I'm not falling for anything. I know full well what Robert is like. Then you'll know he's going to want to see Seb next. Which will be no good for either of you. So do yourself a favour, please throw all this away. Right, there's our taxi. You ready? Actually, I am so sorry, but I... Do you mind if I skip town? I might take Seb for a walk and clear my head. Uh. You should have stayed in hospital. <sighs> I'm fine, don't need to fuss. Being hit by a car and resuscitated is not fine by any stretch of the imagination. So if you're all good enough to do this, I'm going to fuss as much as I like. Got that? Do I have a choice? There you see. Now we're getting somewhere. Ooh. I'm guessing this is for you. What is it? You could always try opening it. To Daddy, thank you for my lovely presents, Seb. Well, you never know. Maybe some good will come out of this after all. Now, get yourself inside. You need to rest. <laughs> 